Hey there, it's Foxtech, and in today's video, we're going to tackle a common problem that some iPhone users may encounter, being unable to check for updates. You know the scenario? You're excited to search for a new update, but suddenly a pop-up appears, giving you only the options to try again or cancel. Don't worry though, because we've got you covered with some troubleshooting steps to fix this issue. The very first thing you should try is the simplest one, restart your iPhone. Power cycling your device is an easy attempt to fix the problem as it removes basic glitches from the software. So give it a try and see if it resolves the issue. Next up, you might want to consider changing the date and time manually on your iPhone, ensure that the date and time are correct, or try altering them slightly to see if that makes a difference. After each fixing attempt, make sure to come back to the software update section and check if anything has changed. If the problem persists, you can try resetting your network settings. To do this, head over to settings, then tap on general, followed by reset, and select reset network settings. After the reset, make sure you have a stable network connection and check if apps are allowed to use data over Wi-Fi and cellular. Try checking for the update again after performing the network reset. Another option you can try is updating your iPhone using iTunes. Simply connect your device to your computer and open iTunes. From there, click on the Check for Update button. This method can sometimes bypass the issue and allow you to check for updates successfully. If you have a beta version running on your device, that could be causing the problem. In this case, try removing the iOS beta profile from your iPhone, restart the device, and then reinstall the profile. Alternatively, you can check for the regular update after removing the beta profile. So those are the tips you need to try out to see if anything has changed and if you can now install the software update on your iPhone. Remember to restart your device, check the date and time settings, reset network settings, try updating through iTunes, and check for beta profiles if applicable. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to Foxtech for more tech tips and troubleshooting guides. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions or other topics you'd like us to cover, feel free to leave them in the comments below. Until next time, peace.